Hi, this is Todd Blummer from SDG Systems, and today I'd like to give you a brief demonstration of how to get our EPX barcode scanning software for Android up and running with an external scanner. First, I'm going to search for EPX in the Google Play Store, which I did, then install the EPX barcode scanner scan now application. This is the core application that is required for any EPX development or applications. I'll go ahead and open that. It is currently using Google Mobile Vision API, which will scan barcodes using the camera. So it scanned through the camera that barcode. Now I'll go back to the Play Store. and go to the Code Corporation driver. So we've added support for scanners from Code Corporation and from Zebra, also known as Motorola Solutions or Symbol. And this configuration sheet that we have over here is the configuration sheet to set up the Code CR2300 or 2600 with the modem cradle uh, so the cradle connects by USB and then the scanner connects by Bluetooth to the cradle so we'll go ahead and install that all right now let's go ahead and plug that in and it's going to ask me do I want to use this by default when a device of this type is connected? I'm not sure why it's bouncing back and forth, but we'll just quickly say OK there. Now we'll go ahead and relaunch our Scan Now application. Go into our settings and select scanner and we will select the code corporation scanner instead of selecting the camera. Now I'm going to go ahead and pair it with the cradle by scanning the barcode on the cradle. It has a quick connect code on it. And now we can start scanning barcodes by Bluetooth into this application. And you can share those. Say you want to save it to Google Drive or you want to send a list by email. It has easy sharing capability right out of the box. If you want something more sophisticated, you can install our Data List Manager application, which has some in-app billing capabilities of saving right directly to Google Sheets, for example. So we'll select the code modem and a default list. Go into settings here and turn on synchronize this to Google Sheets. And we're going to synchronize all lists and we are going to create a single Google Sheets document and each one of the lists will be stored on a different tab in that document. This is the EPX software from SDG Systems. It's available for end users and for programmers to write their own applications with a free SDK that is available. For more information, go to sdgsystems.com.